Hello Lunar Child, welcome now to Monday. Thank you for logging in. Well, it looks like it's sunny, social, and fun today for the crabs. Your home planet, the moon, is in Taurus, which stabilizes you and makes you feel a lot more social than usual. Great time to go out and hand out business cards, network, have lunch with the girlfriends, do stuff out there in society, shake hands, kiss babies, whatever that sort of thing is required for you to get out there and market yourself. Great marketing time. Sometimes cancers will go uh, they'll, t they'll go to the dark side of the moon, take things a little too personally of what a friend says during this time, but I find that's pretty rare, and I think most of the planets today are all in your favor, and in everyone's favor, frankly. It's a happy, happy day. As a bit of the sun, we're in chapter one of Sun in Virgo. Today, Venus is ruling the day, and if you watched Friday's horoscope, I was predicting a breakdown or breakthrough in your thinking on Saturday. A breakdown or breakthrough in your thinking. Today, Venus is ruling the day, so today's the day to restore balance and order. That's what Venus does. It rebalances, it reharmonizes, it makes things beautiful. So today is a day to heal. If you had a breakdown, if you fell into a mental pit of despair, of worry, or something like that, well, let's bring it back up. Let's be positive. Let's heal. Let's bring as much good energy that, we ha that you had negative energy over the weekend. And if you had a breakthrough, which means you finally understood why it is you're so mean to yourself, or why it is people talk to you in a mean way, you're like, oh my gosh, it's everyone acting like my grandmother always used to. That would be a breakthrough. Well, let's build on that. Let's build on that. Let's create. Let's create new habits. Let's create new thoughts. And for those of you who are messengers or basically writers or on camera like me for a living, this is a great creative writing day for you as well. Now, it's not all gravy. Saturn is in Libra, as you well know, and there's some major turbulence going on spiritually when it comes to your home and family unit here in the next 10 days. Saturn has returned to where it left off in January. Saturn got to four degrees, then it started to retrograde back into Virgo. Saturn is back to four degrees, which means we are picking up where we left off in the Libra vibration. It means cancers are picking up where they left off in January with self-nurturing home and family issues, okay? So I am predicting breakdown, basically. Parts of your family, parts of the way you nurture yourself are gonna break down. What used to work won't work. Used to be you could take a bath and feel all better. Now that's not enough. Well, now you're gonna have to go deeper and have to nurture more. Or if you've had conflict in the family, could really come to a major head. Whatever breaks down though, just let it break down. That is my advice. And by Friday, we'll be talking about this, I'm expecting some breakthrough activity with Mars, but more on that on Friday. And it's Monday, so we've got Julie Zipper's meditation vibration going live today. She's doing chapter two of Sun and Virgo. She's going to help you with a guided meditation that in your case will help you with your mind. Okay, so if you're having a hard time getting on top of those thoughts and turning them positive, meditation is the key. Remember your mind is only one of the 12 states of awareness. Meditation gets you out of it, gets you into your soul and out of just the thought patterns. And Julie's here to help you. We all are, but she's here today and she's live everywhere, Soul Garden Streams. Okay, Cancer, that's all you have for Monday. Now tomorrow, Mercury Retrograde shows some breakthrough thinking in your thinking. All that and more in 24, live, love, be. Soul Garden.